Hello traders, how are you doing? It's Abhishek here again. So, in this video, uh, I'm going to discuss about the current scenario of the market. So, if you are following in my Facebook page, in my Facebook page, I have been posting. I, I did initially post about January being bearish. So, we saw a rally from around 26th of December that is still running. Okay. So we have not still seen that bearishness. Okay, there were phases around um, 13th, 15th where we saw some sort of bearishness, but bearishness hasn't kicked in. It's still an uptrend. So, but there is a pattern. So, so the point I'm trying to make is, in GAN analysis, you sort of know what's coming. That's the added advantage you have over other traders. Because we forecast market, we try to foresee what's coming rather than we taking it by surprise. So I know that there is a very strong pattern coming if I have to go back to my nifty. Okay. So in my nifty analysis, I am very clear that the monthly analysis is showing me that January is bearish. Okay. So I know by experience because this pattern I have been observing for some time that market has to come below the opening level of the month at least by 2%. So from the current levels we are talking about 5% drop almost. Okay. So what I have seen is the more you get delays the dangerous it becomes. So delays I have not seen more than 2 months. In fact, if you remember, I forecasted the 500 point drop after September low broke this exactly and we got that 600 points. If you have not watched that video, please do watch it where I already forecasted that it's going to happen. Most of you guys were long. I mean, people, most of you guys in the sense like most of the retailers were long. But I clearly told if this low broke and the strategy is also given out, guys. If you have not watched the videos, please subscribe and see okay so here again guys so here again guys i believe okay this pattern is very weak and and there are a few friends of mine i am not an iliad wave expert okay who also say that even iliad wave is confirming the same okay so now the question as a trader is we don't trade on direction alone traders make money in levels okay that's the most important factor so 8372 guys is an important GAN level okay it's not a big jargon if you know square of nine you should be able to figure out why am I saying this 8372 so if you see market is taking support in 8372 safe traders wait for a close below 8372 then you can initiate the trades in fact if you see if you this whole if you see this whole up move right it I can mark it as a pre budget rally so if you ask me what sort of levels I'm looking for, I did already mention that if I look at my monthly chart, I'm bearish actually on from the monthly perspective. So monthly perspective, I've seen that change come because from the positional perspective, I'm bearish. So when I charted earlier of the month, okay, because one of the important GAN levels broke and then again it bounced back. So I got a 250 points, I think stop loss, which is a part of the game. I'm fine with it. Absolutely. But once I saw this up move, I know something big is coming on the cards. Okay. So as a trader, you know, always need to keep in mind the risk reward ratio. That's how it makes money. Okay. So if you are keeping a, your reward is, you know, 50 paisa intraday and your risk is 3 rupees, then you aren't doing justice at all. Okay. So what, whatever strategy you are following, okay, you need to make sure in the long term, the risk reward is taken into factor. Every long term trader who is a full time trader who relies, who treats this as his business, considers this factor in every trade of his. Okay, there will be that odd 60 points, 120 point uh, stop loss hit. I'm talking about positional stop loss is it. But you will make money provided you stick to it so now because our added advantage is we know the GAN analysis we know the direction of the market we believe it's going to be bearish okay so when i should initiate 8372 i'll watch a close below it i'll initiate i go with the disclaimer guys this this i am making you guys this video i am making 
to let you guys know that there is something else going goes on in the market which is called you know forecasting for the future there are various ways of forecasting i do it mathematically people are, have different other ways elliot waves is also there people do it astrologically okay so we have an added advantage if you know and i do it via simple mathematics guys if you want to know if you want to know how do i do it okay you can email me anytime and if you have any questions you let me know and for now i mean let's just just wait for the market to see how it reacts i may be wrong i'm not saying but please do your own analysis don't go by this okay if you don't understand this video skip this video at all okay but if you uh, if you like it if you think that there is something please do like please do subscribe and please do follow on my facebook page thank you very much guys and until next time bye bye